Hi, I'm Sally with Bob Johnson's Computer Stuff. Today we're going to be using a Panasonic Toughbook CF30 to demonstrate what shortcuts can be used when using this Toughbook, which is running a Windows 7 operating system. And we're going to show exactly how these shortcuts can enhance the experience for the user and make their browsing capability and their interface, their overall interface, a lot more easier to navigate. So for those of you who aren't familiar, the CF30 is the predecessor of the CF31, which is considered the most fully rugged computer in the world. Uh, and also it has magnesium alloy encasing, as well as great certifications, which just, such as the ingress protection certification and the military standard certification, which are just all certifications which verify its ruggedness. So we're going to get right into this tutorial. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Okay, we have our computer on and we're going to start showing some of these shortcuts now. So say for example you want to open up a new tab and start browsing the web or something along those lines. You can use the shortcut Control T which would open up a new tab. Of course the browser has to be open first. <laughs> Once the browser is open There you go, it's a pretty simple hack, but you can open up as many tabs as possible just by simply connect, clicking Control T. One other shortcut is um, screen capture, which is Control Print Screen, and that copies images to your clipboard, and you can then paste that image to a image editor like paint or photoshop so i used control print control v control v being paste and that allowed me to paste the screen to my to my <clears throat> image editor. To save documents such as this, you can click Control S, which prompts you to save your file. You can save it under whatever name you prefer. We're going to just call this Test Photo. Save, and also if you want to print something, you can click Control P and that brings up the print prompt as you can see right here we're not going to print it right I'm going to close out all of our tabs and bring up a word editor I'm going to type a quick sentence like test 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 this is really a test in notepad period All right um, I don't know I don't know if you can see that text but it's right there uh, let me pan up for you alright there's the text now I'm hitting control F and it actually gives you a prompt or a search bar to look up whatever word you want to edit. Um, so you can find whatever word. We're going to click in test or is and then find next. Cannot find is. Hmm. Test. And there you see it's highlighted the word test here in the corner. Um, so this is this definitely comes in handy when you have like pages and pages of, of data and words and documents that you want to cipher through and find a specific word. That allows you to do it by simply clicking Control F. Um, of course, there's always you know simple copy and paste 
Control C, Control V. That pretty much sums up our shortcuts for today. Thank you for tuning in. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. And if it was, don't forget to hit the like button as well as subscribe to our channel. If you didn't like the video, hit the dislike button. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. Also, remember sharing is caring. So if you could, please share our video to as many people as possible. Uh, all, all feedback and support is greatly appreciated um, from us. So thank you. Until next time. Thanks for watching today. For more repair videos, click the link below. And remember, if you have a screwdriver, you can fix a computer. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching today. For more repair videos, click the link below. And remember, if you have a screwdriver, you can fix a computer. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.